Welcome back. Today, we continue our segment on note linking in AmpleNote by looking at the philosophy of networked thought more generally. To help us do this, we will be building a system for taking meeting notes in AmpleNote using note references and daily jots. Our problem for today is meeting notes. My friend Bill is a work colleague, but also a friend of mine. We meet often and discuss things that I want to take notes on. What is the best system for organizing my meeting notes with Bill? And just to help us wrap our heads around this, here are some hints. Let's start with the simplest solution, which is one note for every meeting. It's pretty straightforward. Every time a new meeting happens, I use the new note button. This note is a work meeting with Bill. And let's say it happened today. Then I just take notes on what was discussed during that meeting. That was a work meeting. Later the same day, if I have a friendly meeting with Bill, I can do something similar. I can create a new note called personal meeting with Bill today. That's pretty good, but I will end up with quite a few notes this way. Also, what happens if I have a meeting with Sarah today? That's even more notes. I probably need to tag this note with Sarah to group together all of my Sarah notes, but I also need a tag to mark that this was a personal meeting between friends. And looking over my notes, we actually discussed shared rituals, which is a very interesting idea I want to keep track of. That would be yet another tag. Can we do better? To start off our solution, let's change the approach. What if we could take notes directly in the daily jot? After all, meeting notes are closely tied to the day the meeting happened. Let's test that out. In my daily jot, I can type in personal meeting with Sarah, then insert all of my notes below that. And now I'll make sure the word Sarah here is actually a link to a note dedicated for Sarah. Compared to our first solution, this already saves me a bunch of trouble because daily jots are created automatically. All I have to do is start typing. And if I visit Sarah's page, I can see a list of all of my Sarah notes in the backlinks. Here's how the same thing looks for my meeting with Bill. And here's my other meeting with Bill that was work related. Can you see the next move? What would be the easiest way to organize notes into work and personal? If you were thinking, link the words work meeting, you would be completely right. I can use two inline tags on the same line, one for the person and the other for the meeting type. This way of taking notes feels more natural to me because I'm only using natural language I would use anyway, a work meeting with Bill. As long as I link the important words, my notes are automatically organized. To prove that, let's navigate to Bill's note. In the backlinks section, I can see a list of all of the meetings I've ever had with him. And if I want to only see my personal meetings with him, I can filter this list and shift click on work meeting to exclude references that contain this note. This is pretty powerful already. More generally, I am able to do this trick where I linked two notes from the same paragraph because my notes are small and self-contained. We call these notes atomic notes. Atomic notes encapsulate a single idea or object or person, and they serve a single purpose. My bill note is for notes about bill. My personal meeting note is for grouping together friendly meetings. And remember when I mentioned I'm interested in the idea of shared rituals? That's another atomic note I'd like to create and link to. Also, my work meeting was related to our work project to simplify onboarding, so I'll add this tag as well. 
Simplify onboarding is another atomic note because its only responsibility is to encapsulate tasks and notes about this specific project. Sometimes I like my atomic notes to remain empty and not actually have any content inside them. They serve their purpose if I can link to them, no problem. But other times I like writing notes inside them. For example, in my bill note, I can keep an ongoing to-do list of topics to discuss. In this video, we went over the advantages of working from the daily jots and linking to atomic notes. This combination lets us organize notes we take throughout the day without ever leaving the daily jot. As long as we create self-contained notes that serve a single purpose, we can organize all of our note-taking using inline tags straight from the daily jot.